There's two red admirals. They're a very flighty butterfly. They're both feeding here. I'll see if I can get close to get a good shot of them feeding. Oh look, one has just landed right here. Oh, and another one. Wow. That's one. Two. Up. Oh. And those other two have left now. But there's a red admiral. This one's looking rather battered. Probably towards the end of its life now. I have three rowan trees here. One right here, one right there. And that one's not really heavily fruiting, whereas this third one is. And I'm gonna do something a bit controversial. Its branches are so light that I'm gonna take a lot of its fruit off because you can see how it's bending over with the weight of the fruit. But I want these to mature and have as many branches as possible. So I'm gonna take off, see how it's already lifted itself and see if a bird landed on these branches to feed, it might break, be the last bit and the branch might break. So lightening the load. Uh, but this makes it so that in future, this tree will have strong branches. Even this little one right here will have strong branches to bear more fruit. Mm. I just had a fly fly in my mouth. How delicious. Extra protein, except I spat it out. So that branch jumps up again. So it's basically preserving the tree for future years rather than breaking its branches when it's young. And I'll pull that off of it. There we go. And that will give it more of a chance and its branches more of a chance to um, produce food in future years. And that's basically a bit of, you know, maintenance management. Now, there's some up there near the top. I'd love to get that little bit and take it uh, down a bit. So, oh look, beautiful moth in there. I don't know if you could see it. Look, the horse chestnuts are forming their chestnuts. Let's see this one. And then this, let's see if I can do this. Oh dear, there we go. I'm just kind of squeezing them off as if I'm a bird eating them. So there, that lightens the load and the branches all go up again. And you see that one was bent over double like that and I've let it lift up. Isn't that right? Are you learning something new? Hmm? Yes. Environmental puppies. Learning how to look after trees. Yes. See, normally a deer probably would have browsed this and shortened the branches and thick and so they'd thicken the next time they bore fruit. But there's no deer here. So there's a human. So I'm doing what the deer would have done. That one is fine. It doesn't have too much weight on it. For some reason, this one's fruiting really, really well. 
which is great. Next year, it'll be even better.